Spot the area on your boiler that looks like what you see on the picture. An insulating screw joint with a wire attached to both ends with the letters T and A underneath. Now remove the wire. Instead, we are going to connect the two tie box 5100 wires. Connect the grey wire to the T and the black one to the A. Next, we will associate the tie box 5100 to your TDM 1.0. Get in touch with your retailers. The tie box 5100 is delivered pre-associated. Transmitter and receiver are associated with each other. To associate your TieBox 5100 with your TDM 1.0, go to the TDM application. Now, click on the heating icon. If this type of product is not yet associated, a window prompting you to select one will appear automatically. Select the third image, the one that looks like your product, then confirm. A list of products associated with the image now appears on the screen. At this point, we will check for any errors. Here, you can read TieBox 5100, which is the product reference that we want to associate, which means that we have selected the right product. Confirm again. Select the available network. For example, I have selected Network 2, on which I can associate 16 products. Confirm again. You will now be prompted to switch your TieBox 5100 to association mode. Press on the button on the top of the TieBox 5100. A flashing red LED comes on, indicating that the tie box 5100 is now operating in association mode. Return to the tablet and press start to run a device search. As your tie box 5100 is operating in association mode, the TDM application will automatically recognize it. The application will then register the new device as heating device, which will be added to the relevant menu. A window asking you whether you want to associate new product devices will appear. Press no, unless you need to add other devices. You can now rename your product to make it more readily identifiable in your home, for example. In this example, it will be called home. This way you can find your device via the application if you have a doubt. Click on locate. A red LED will flash quickly on the top of the product you're trying to locate. When you are ready, confirm once, then twice to finalize the association of your TieBox 5100. Press back to return to the product management interface. The application's heating menu is now open. It includes the list of all the associated heating devices. We can actually see the TieBox 5100, renamed to Home, by pressing the information icon on the top right hand corner of your device's box, you will find relevant key information. To return to the TieBox 5100 management page, click on the cross. To change the state on the tablet, touch the horizontal bar and drag it vertically to edit the temperature setting. Colors for temperatures and the smiley on the top right hand corner of the box help you to check that the temperature setting is OK and in line with environmental standards. To return to the device association interface, click on the tool icon in the top right hand corner of your screen. Press the device with your finger to rename it, locate it or switch back to the device's association mode. If you click on general, you can add a new product, remove products, remove them all simultaneously or return to the product association mode. Click on the arrow in the top left corner of the box to return to the device association interface. To return to the product management interface, press the arrow in the top left corner of the box once, then twice to return to the main menu.